Kane Cooper, HVAC Chronicles. Welcome back, guys. We got a good one today. Um, this is the condensate pump, all right? This probably be familiar to you guys that have one in your basement or up in your attic. Usually, it's going to probably be the same setup. I'm going to just let you know. All right, so you got your three-quarter elbow PVC running down. Usually, you guys have a part of your P-trap, okay? But uh, this one's set up a little different. Vinyl tubing, got your clamp. So, this is what goes to the pump all right as you can see so that water is going to run out and go probably outside all right or go to a, a place where it can drain safely with no type of puddle or flood anywhere in the house or wherever you're at all right so today what we're going to do is we're going to take this apart and see does it work hmm y'all want to have fun doing that all right follow me all right first thing first let's turn off this power yeah power is off all right guys power off let's take off this vinyl tubing look at all that crud before i take that off look at that see and i'm gonna show you a trick at the end or tell you a trick at the end that'll prevent and minimize this type of crud building up in your system all right all right vinyl tubing that's off pvc this one ain't glued so i'll just take that off all right guys so we know our power is off not that it's a big deal but i like to teach safety first so if it's ready to light up with power nope it's blue so that means that our power is off so let me show you when the power is on what's going to happen So now it's hot. All right, guys. So let's just turn that off. Ah, all right, that's off. All right, what we want to do is we want to take this top off. I want to see what's in here. I'm curious to see what's in this thing. Let's see what's in this daggone thing. Oop, empty and dry as a bone. Hmm. No wonder it haven't been working. I don't know if they've been running the AC. Or well, something clogged up. We're going to find out the data. All right. So what you want to do is, guys, make sure if you got any crud, this one is not that pretty much dirty. But let's make sure that we want to wet our rag. Do the other side. Try to get it halfway wet. This is the water I'm going to use. To put it in there, there. All right, so it's nice and wet a little bit. So we're gonna clean this out, clean this crud out. Try to do the best job you could do. I don't, I don't expect it to be perfect, but this is what you guys are gonna be doing on your own condensate pump. All right, bear with me because I'm working with one hand and recording. All right. Right. All right. All right, guys. This is what we're gonna do. We're gonna take the residuals, and what we're gonna do with that? Just, just put it right here for right now. All right. So I cleaned out pretty decent. I could do a better job, but like I said, I have lack of hand power. <laughs> so I'm just giving you a quick tutorial and we can go from there okay let's get back to the video uh what you're gonna do is we don't know if this works or not i really don't so first things first let's pour some water in here make sure you fill it up to at least about halfway or three-quarter way so it can senses that and once it senses that it should pull it in where it sucks through the vinyl tubing which is this like i told you guys all right so let's put it back let's see what we got
Let's do it. All right. Put the top back on. But let me show you this plunger. That's the plunger, guys. All right. That's the plunger also, guys. This is more than likely what's going to be in the bottom of your condensate pump. All right. So let's put this top back on. All right. Let's hook back up this vinyl tubing. Look at that, guys. All that crud, we're not standing for that. All right. That's on. I'm going to put this back on here. You guys are not going to have to take that off. All right. You're not going to have to take that off. All you're going to have to do is take off your vinyl tubing. So let me stick that in there. All right. Oh, guys, we're a little. There we go. All right. So that's off. Okay. So let's turn back on our power. Power on. Now you see, guys? You see how that water is, is, is draining up in there? And you can hear it. You can feel it. Look at that guy. It's sucking all that water up. And it stops once it gets to a certain type of height. It has to be a certain height for it to start sucking the water up through this vinyl tube and outside probably. Yours is probably going to be outside, all right? So remember, guys. This is the tip, tip of the day. Tip of the day to get rid of this corrosion and all this crud and stuff like that that's going through here. You wanna put two teaspoons of vinegar inside your condensate pump. You got holes right here, knockout holes, or a hole right here you can use if it's accessible without glue to put down there, okay? So at least two tablespoons of vinegar, maybe every three months, you know, I usually do it every six, but every three is probably fine. Make sure you clean the bottom of the crud, guys. And today's video has been amazing. And we're back with another one on my other channel, Mozalia Kingdom Gaming. Tune into that. We get y'all some nice content on that. But today, guys, condensate pump. Make sure this stuff is cleaned out. One-on-one. -on -one. Peace.